today has been a stressful morning already. We were trying to find a place where they sell sim. There's quite a few, but to find a place that sells sim and speaks English at the same time is very difficult here. Should have already got it sorted at the airport, but we was quite in a rush to get to the hotel. So I managed to get my sim sorted this morning. Um, we asked the lady downstairs who worked at the reception and she was really helpful. But I said she's a uh, her English is not very good, but she does really try. We managed to get there at the end, and there was a phone shop uh, a few minutes away from us. So we went there and we got my phone sorted. So for 120,000 Vietnamese dong, I got like 1.2 gigabyte of internet for like a month. So we're only going to be here for a maximum of two weeks, because that's how um, that's how long we can stay here for with our visa. We was going to catch a train down to Ho Chi Minh City, but it's uh it's like their whole national holiday like this week. So all the trains and everything's fully booked so we're gonna spend uh, two extra days here in Oyan but uh, that means we'll leave us uh, a few things to do here and I think we're gonna rent a scooter from our place because uh, it's much cheaper pretty much but the traffic and the people here are crazy on the, on the road so hopefully we won't die on the scooter. Uh, as a quick side note as well like when you're flying from different countries um, because you don't have a return ticket like every time we go check in, they always ask for your onward travel, so they will prove onward travel. Not a lot of people know about it, so a lot of people will tend to miss it. Just make sure that um, you have a flight going out. It's so like uh, we've been lucky so far because Bali, we had a flight going out to the Philippines, and the Philippines we had flights going out to, from Philippines to Vietnam. But since we got to Vietnam, we hadn't had the flight because we we're gonna catch the buses through the borders to Cambodia and Thailand. So we had to purchase pretty much just any a ticket, a cheapest ticket on Skyscanner and we just purchased it like to Malaysia or something like that. The other option is you can just go to the airport and just risk it and then if they do ask you can just like get into there and just book it on the on the spot. Fish restaurant, and we just ordered some. I ordered some like oh yeah, and special noodles and jellos and baguette. Yeah, um, a chicken baguette. A chicken baguette. A chicken baguette. A, a chicken baguette. <laughs> and uh, I don't know. We just saw the TripAdvisor sign with like top reviews. Supposed to be like top 25 places in in Hoi An. So yeah, we went with this one. Just a little bit off the beach front. So the beach over there. You walk a little bit. Do -do 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 -do, and you just come over here. And it's literally like so much. Well, not so much. It's a little bit cheaper. It's funny, um, like when you go to the menu, like all the, the the people just approach you and it's like, oh, come in, let's taste the food, big portions, but yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> and then the other lady was just like, oh, you're very beautiful, like to me. <laughs> it's the Jade, yeah. So she said to Jade, like, oh, yeah, you're very beautiful, and you can smile. You know, they seem very nice here. They're very smiley people, so it's quite nice. back at our place and we're still pretty early so we decided we're going to gym. Yeah, 50,000, you get a day pass. Might take my GoPro with me, might not, and then uh, might film a little bit, I don't know. So we're just going to do a quick back workout. You got all the machines over there, you got all the weights. Just got back from the gym and it was so sweaty, I'm so sweaty. I get it's pretty sweaty at the moment as well. Yeah, so it was a good workout. We haven't been to the gym for like a month. Yeah, because there's like literally no gym at all where we've been in the Philippines, no gym around us. So it was nice to get back in there and do some workout.
So we just stopped at this cute uh, little restaurant. Food prices here is pretty much just standard prices everywhere. So everywhere you guys gonna be expensive. So we might as well go on somewhere really nice. As well as the restaurant, you have bars all across down there. So it's pretty neat. Might have to come back here another time. We was talking about it in on the boat as well when we was at the gym. Like, so we were doing some lap pull downs. So we were taking turns doing different sets. And literally, like this guy, and he just literally—I was always about to go on uh, after Jade, and like he just literally jumped in and like just jumped in on the machine while I was literally standing right next to it. It was like so weird. Like I didn't even know what was going on, but he didn't even ask or say anything. He didn't even look at us. He just went on the machine, and then he went off, and I just went back on. So that was a bit weird. Well, this is why you call heaven's gay. If you slip, you definitely go to heaven. <laughs> or hell. Depends how you see it.